Take down Kentucky today. Felt good. Um, you know, just like they they do and we do, we just go out and play the win. So, uh, we did everything we had to do down the stretch. We were very tough down the stretch. And, uh, you know, if you would have told me 258 down by eight toward anyone, I, I don't think they would have thought that we could come out of that one. So that just shows our toughness and what type of team we really are. I asked you about the, your dunk yesterday kind of changing the course of the game. Lamonte's three, 30 seconds to go. Yeah. What can you tell me about that shot? I mean, he, he works hard just as anyone. And he's been struggling, you know, from three. And, you know, we trust him because he, he's proven that he can take the big shot and not have a big shot. So when I saw that he was open, I mean, I, I would be selfish to not give him the opportunity to knock it down. So passing the ball, and I mean, everyone else on the floor knew it was going in when he was saying because he just let it go. So it was, it was great for him, for us, but great for him too. Heard you say after the game, one more. You got Auburn coming up next. Having won that SEC tournament title since '79, I know that y'all have been asked a lot about that. But what could that mean for y'all to get that done? It would mean a lot. It would mean a lot for our program, uh, us as a team, but you know, for our nation especially. Right on, man. How many times has you seen Grant take a corner three in that kind of moment? Uh, not many times, but when he when he left his hand, I started smiling because I knew it was going. I knew it was going. Is that how you felt about yours too? Yeah, I did. I did. Uh, I mean, I think I went like four for nine, or four for eight, or something like that. But I mean, the biggest thing is shooters keep shooting. I'm a shooter and I put in a lot of time in the gym. I'm not going to shy away from taking a big shot or taking a shot. So you got to keep shooting, got, got, to, got to keep being aggressive. And towards the end, we just got great looks and made great plays in the defensive end and on the glass. So uh, that's what really won us the game. And, and Jordan Bones, eight for eight from the free throw line, really, really sealed the deal for us. Seems like at this point, there's not a whole lot that separates Kentucky and Tennessee, maybe experience. Did you feel like that was something you could lean on as you tried to make your move? There's got a bunch of young guys trying to make those pressure plays. Uh, I wouldn't say it has anything to do with youth. Uh, uh, it was just, you know, it was a competitive game, and we, we made plays down the stretch. They have talent and, and talented players, and you know, guys that can make big shots. We got guys that can make big shots. It was just, you know, it's just it's how the game went for us. And um, you know, we played really hard. And we didn't get down. We were down by eight with 2:58 to go. We just kept pushing, and we were, we were tough enough to, you know, finish the game.